is Douglas fir. This is uh, Pseudosuga menziesii. Bit of a mouthful, but Douglas fir is its common name. And Douglas fir really represents the top end of uh, production conifers, production softwoods in the UK. It's quite a demanding species. It needs relatively deep soils, relatively fertile soils, and it can be frost tender when it's young. It's also highly palatable to deer. So um, if you have a high deer population uh, and you're going to plant Douglas fir, you need to be very, very careful and take appropriate action to try and give your young trees a chance to get away. But if you can grow Douglas fir successfully, what you will grow is a premium timber, effectively. Douglas fir, as a sawn timber, is in high demand for uh, demanding end uses, timber engineering applications for laminating, for using in big um, clear span timber buildings. Douglas fir is a top end timber, it performs very well in tension and in compression, so it's a top end high specification uh, performance softwood. Douglas fir has a tendency to be particularly well grown in the south and the west of the UK, uh, but it's one of the species that as we embrace and start to deal with climate change, maybe some of the conditions um, in the UK that have previously been less suitable for Douglas fir might actually prove to be more uh, more suitable and we can extend its range and grow a higher volume of this potentially very valuable timber. In terms of ID characteristics, a couple of things to uh, bear in mind and contrast it to the, the spruces that we've seen before. If you look at the needle arrangement with this Douglas fir, it's a slightly different profile. The needles are slightly longer, they're slightly uh, flatter in the way that they're held. They always remind me of eyelashes uh, rather than the sort of bottle brush arrangement. And they're almost flatter and longer along the branches. So the needle arrangement is slightly different to the spruces. One of the key identification characteristic with Douglas fir, if you look at the buds, if you look at the buds on the tips of this young uh, uh, growth here, they're small pointed conical uh, brown buds with a scaly covering to them. So once you get your eye in and can identify them, they're quite distinctive. So small brown but pointed conical buds. Douglas fir um, has these uh, and they're quite a useful way of identifying it and contrasting it to some of the other conifer species that we're going to see.